I can't believe I made it. I actually made it. I didn't think I would make it to Jordan and I didn't think I would make it here. But I did. And it was a big coincidence that this place opened when it did. And when it did, I had to come here. I knew I just had to. And I'm really glad I did because I learnt a lot of lessons from being here. Where am I? Well, today is April the 25th. This place has been open for just over a month and we are in the Banksy suite of the Waldorf Hotel, the worst view in the world. And this is the suite with an IDF soldier and Palestinian having a pillow fight. This is my bed, my stuff, and basically this entire hotel is, this room and this hotel is a work of art. I had to sign for a deposit coming in here to say that um, no, if any damage happens, I can't even lose the room key. And I'll show you a little bit later why. If I do, there's a $150 fine. Everything in here has been decorated according to how Banksy has wanted it. I'm not even sure if the cupboard... I have a hairdryer! I haven't even looked in here yet. And a, a safe. This is a legit hotel room. And um, it's it's surreal. It's the artwork. The feathers even extend this way. And let's take let's take you around the room and let's see what we'll find here. We have Breaking news on your TV screen, which is not a TV screen. This whole hotel has a British theme because it is the British that got everyone into this mess and it is the British that is getting everyone out of it, which you'll soon find once you go to the museum. I love how the feathers even float under this painting here. Bedside lamp. Now, this hotel is billed as the worst view in the world and I'm about to show you why. Someone's flying a kite outside. But um, there's the wall of separation. We're right next to it. I have this eerie sense of dread being next to something like this. I cannot imagine kids playing and living next to it. It's a little vineyard and that is an IDF sentry tower. We saw some soldiers out earlier and I don't know if anyone's manning that tower. I'm pretty sure they would be but let's see. This is the bathroom. Work of art as well as functioning hotel bathroom. The soap, which of course I'm gonna nick one. Bottles, decanters, and this is an unobstructed view of the IDF towers. Concerning looking at that and that they have a clear view of me sleeping is not something I'm thrilled about but uh, I hope these curtains pull in yeah they do I didn't 
like I knew about the conflict existing on the news, but you don't see it nearly in its reality as fully as when you come here. And um, I hope to make the most out of my stay here and see what happens. But I'm just thrilled I've made it here. I'm a bit, I'm a bit like that sentry tower is staring straight at me into my room. See the sentry tower? I'm so not entirely relaxed in my own hotel room because of that. But I'm very grateful for the chance to be here and um, hopefully to share my journey further with the rest of you.